right? You find that most of the developing countries also started getting into the fold of NPO. In fact, late 1997 onwards, many of the countries, developing countries, started experimenting with NPM. Like, which si countries? Thi? African countries, right? Asian countries, Singapore. So, many so, countries. Singapore, to poor advanced, already developed. Tha. But many of these countries started experimenting. South Korea, major experiment with NPM. So, they did a lot of experiments with NPM, right? But eventually, because most of these countries were still in the developing phase, right? The NPM could not provide solutions to their problems. For example, India, right? So India initiated your which program was initiated this time? National E-Governance Program. Before that, ICT 4D, a vision paper was launched relating to technology. So, in spite of these changes, right, most of these countries still faced high level of unemployment, high level of poverty, right? And digital divide was already there. So it was realized that is NPM the appropriate model to bring reforms in these countries or not. So people started raising questions that is NPM 